Top 10 Strangest Roller Coaster Rides on the Planet The best roller coasters are designed to mess with the human psyche and induce a feeling of terror and ecstasy at the same time. Here are the roller coasters that will make your stomach knot and your heart beat. Every year, amusement parks all around the world compete to construct bigger, faster, and more furious rides. The tallest and fastest roller coaster in the vicinity is usually the highlight of any amusement park. Perhaps theme parks promote the number of times the roller coaster flips or the amount of time a ride exposes riders to extreme g-forces. Instead, try a new kind of ride, one with g-forces that will knock you out and gigantic freefall dumps that will have you laughing uncontrollably and praying for your life. Taste the danger and get your adrenaline racing by riding these twists and drops. These coasters have become increasingly daring in their loops and dips, with some even dangling passengers upside down or spraying them with mist for added excitement. We've compiled a list of the strangest and most impressive roller coasters. The roller coasters listed here are the most gut-wrenching and heart-pounding thrill rides available to thrill-seekers. We found some clips that will give you an idea of what to anticipate, have fun, number 10 Inversa. Inversa is a steel inverted shuttle roller coaster in Capo do Canoa, Rio Grande do Sol, Brazil, located at Aqua Locos. It's the kind of inverted roller coaster that leaves your feet dangling. This is already terrifying, but it gets worse. Its V-formed rail permits a terrifyingly fast fall, even over the back. Will you bravely face it or will you cower in fear? The excitement is palpable, pure adrenaline. Experience the pinnacle of La Inversa. The quickest of the three roller coasters available during the Aqua Locos winter season. However, in addition to the entire aquatic section, there is an amusement park with super hyper mega ultra legal roller coasters such as La Inversa, the inverted roller coaster. Mad Montana is Brazil's second largest wooden mountain, while Chua Mountain is a 20 meter high water roller coaster. We go directly to the water on the way down, where the cart can reach 80 km h. Despite my dread of the plunge, I really enjoyed it. An inverted roller coaster is one where the train rides beneath the track and the seats are linked directly to the wheel carriage. Number 9 Looping The most basic of roller coaster inversions is the typical vertical loop, when a segment of track causes the riders to complete a 360-degree turn. Riders are completely inverted at the top of the loop. The vertical loop is not a new roller coaster concept. It dates back to the 1850s, when centrifugal railroads were erected in France and the United Kingdom. The rides depended on centripetal forces to keep the vehicle in the loop. The attraction had a completely circular loop, rather than the teardrop shape utilized by many modern looping roller coasters, which caused neck injuries due to the powerful G-forces pulled by the tight radius of the loop. A roller coaster's loop the loop functions similarly to a merry-go-round. Your inertial velocity is straight ahead of you when the train carriages reach the loop. The coaster vehicle, and hence your body, cannot proceed down this straight course because of the track. Your acceleration pushes you away from the coaster car floor, while your inertia pushes you into it. Number 8 Law Simpson On a virtual reality roller coaster trip with the Simpsons, someone is ruining Crustaland, Krusty the Clown's low-budget amusement park, as the voyage begins, and you'll smash and blast your way through it alongside Homer, Marge, Bart, Lisa, and Maggie in an over-the-top non-stop adventure. Don't be concerned. We'll do everything we can to get you back in one piece. On this indoor simulation, the action feels so real that you're bound to let out a woohoo or two. As you soar across Springfield and beyond, keep a lookout for cameos from a slew of Simpsons characters. Back to the future. The ride is similar to the Simpsons ride in that it features a simulator ride, which it previously was, before it was closed and replaced. It uses 80 foot of max dome displays to transport riders to Number 7 Pipeline Express. Pipeline Express was a steel roller coaster at Grand Prairie, Texas's Boardwalk Fun Park. The coaster was the newest auto sled model from Bailey Manufacturing of Cameron, Ontario when it was built in 1992. Each of the five sleds could accommodate one rider. Riders were seated in a small car with railings on both sides for support. The station was at the highest point on the trip, which meant that the lift hill was at the very end. The ride attendant would push the automobile forward to leave trains with only one car. For a total of one rider per car, riders are lined up in a single row. Roller coaster thrills for a fraction of the price. From a 50 tower, you can see up to 1,000 feet. With a natural hill, any length is possible. Number 6 Roller Ball The Wurstelprater in Vienna, Austria, 
has a fourth dimension roller coaster called Rollerball. Kern and Waldman, an Austrian showman family, owns it. Trains with only one car. Riders are seated in two rows, for a total of four people each car. Back to back seating is provided in each row. A roller coaster is a cross between a wild mouse and a spinning coaster. It's unclear whether this type is named after one of the two films, but it could be since the short story on which both films are based is titled Rollerball Murder. Passengers have the sensation of being a pinball while safely running down the track in a four-seat gondola with individual lap bars on this vertical coaster. The gondola swings around the vertical bends in combination with a free-fall sense due to acceleration and deceleration. Number 5 Gliding Coaster Reverchen's Gliding Coaster was first introduced in 2000. It's a wild mouse roller coaster inverted. There are just two known to have been built. Following its debut, the Chinese business Golden Horse began construction on a very similar roller coaster, suspended coaster XGC4A, which has since become more popular. Yuwalda operates the Euro Coaster, a traveling roller coaster. Reverchen's wild mouse roller coaster is suspended. It's one of Reverchen's two known gliding coaster designs, the other being a Lad Delta. Golden Horse, a Chinese manufacturer, has created multiple suspended coaster XGC4A models that are quite similar. Trains with only one car. A total of four riders per car are arranged four abreast in a single row. Over the shoulder straps keep riders in place. The 98.9 one foot chain lift hill is used for rides. Riders descend to the right from the top of the lift, reaching speeds of 50.20 mph at the bottom. Number 4 Illusion The Coma's Illusion product was designed for enclosed installations and was patented by the business. It featured a train that was unusually long. The Coma's Illusion roller coaster is a fully enclosed tubular steel roller coaster. It runs on Vicoma's MK700 track system, which is a Monero. Chaos in Operaland USA, Tennessee, and Revolution slash Mount Mara in Baba Jomland were both erected in 1989, Belgium. Only one of them, in Belgium, is still operational. The Illusion operates a single long train with up to 30 carriages that can stretch up to 180 in length. Each thin car seats two persons in a bobsled style configuration. Number 3 Tower Coaster The Tower Coaster will take you around the historic Zip World Tower site achieving speeds of up to 25 mph over a distance of more than a kilometer. The coaster is an exhilarating way to see Tower Colliery up close with tunnels, bank corners, dips, and peaks. Tower Colliery was once the UK oldest continuously working deep coal mine, with a fascinating story behind it as the only coal mine run by a cooperative of workers in the late 1990s and early 2000s. Zip World's Phoenix Zip Line is the ultimate group experience, with two separate zip zones and four parallel lines in each, including the world's fastest seated zip line. As you soar through the skies on Zip World's steepest zip line, take in the stunning views of the Rigos Mountains and the ancient mining tower colliery site. Number 2 Queen Bee Queen Bee is a family inverted roller coaster at Bottens, Pleasure Beach in Skegness, Lincolnshire, England. Pinfari created it, and it is located on top of a building. The layout of the ride is tight, with the lift hill passing through a beehive, seven cars in a single train. Riders are arranged three across in a single row in each vehicle, for a total of 21 riders each train. Each automobile is shaped like a bee. It has three dips in the track, just like an adult coaster. The Queen Bee has a top speed of 13 mph. This coaster is ideal for families, children, and those who prefer not to ride fast. The Queen Bee has seven distinct cars, each of which can hold three people. Did you know? The Queen Bee's trail measures 410 feet long. The Queen Bee's highest point is 22 feet. Number 1 Astral Astral is a spectacular gravity suspended roller coaster that provides a thrilling experience for both spectators and riders. It's a silky smooth ride with excellent acceleration and speed. This attraction is the result of our team's inventiveness and expertise, which is always working to provide excitement while keeping safety in mind. To avoid using concrete foundations, this ride was built with a steel basement. The Fabry Group is a Kalta-based amusement ride manufacturer. The Booster and the Kamikaze Explorer are two of their most well-known attractions for both amusement parks and funfairs. That concludes today's video. If you've made it this far in the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you again in the next one.